What's up team, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today we're just going to have a short quick brief video to celebrate all the green that's in the market right now. Hence I have replaced my traditional orange bucket hat with this green leprechaun hat up there because the market has been really lucky to us and we are really fortunate to be making the gains that we have been making. Now a lot of you may still be wondering why there is a lot of green especially in our YouTube portfolio and that is because the infrastructure bill has been passed and is sitting on Uncle Mr. President of the United States of America Joe Biden's desk as we speak at least at the time of this recording and as far as I am aware. So um, from the infrastructure bill long story short they did um, insist on 7.7 .7 billion dollars into EV and EV related stuff such as charging and as you know if you have been following my channel we are quite convicted into ChargePoint and Volta. So since that news, Volta now in our portfolio has jumped up to around 61% returns and ChargePoint around 45.2% returns. I do want to point out over here that in my private portfolios, I did buy Volta and ChargePoint at very similar price points, but rather than holding, which is what I intend to do with this YouTube portfolio, I have trimmed a little bit, especially off ChargePoint, just because it ran up so fast in such a short amount of time, it did occupy quite a heavy portion in my portfolio. So just letting you know that I have trimmed charge point and I have done a little bit of profit taking. But like I said, since um, this portfolio is quite small, um, I, for me at least, for the stocks that do have a lot more long term potential, I don't feel like it is the right time to sell yet. Volta, um, I am swing trading this as well privately. And I feel like once I've at least had a nice run privately, I do plan on selling. Um, for the YouTube portfolio, I might do something similar. I am not too sure yet. We will see how it goes because 61% in the two to three weeks that we've held it is already really really good but maybe we might hit a home run and what classifies as a home run is when we double our money so yeah we are almost there um we shall see not much else to talk about um except two brand new holdings which i will get into shortly once we hop onto xl but because of the infrastructure bill cleveland cliffs also experienced a pretty nice boost now DraftKings is still our only stock in the red i am still really bullish on DraftKings. i feel like right now is a great price to buy it if you haven't started dollar cost averaging in. Citigroup has pretty much just neutralized um, itself. If we sell it now, we actually lose a bit of money once Hatch does its thing. So yeah, that is our YouTube public portfolio update up around 630 New Zealand dollars, which is absolutely stellar, absolutely excellent in my books. With $630, that's enough to cover um, your bills minus your rent for at least a month. Um, which is pretty pretty solid. It's also enough to treat yourself. I'm thinking of getting a new mountain bike for Christmas So um, who knows I won't cash out of this public portfolio, but privately that's something that I am considering Now I will just quickly jump onto XL to show you that I am not bullshitting in terms of percentages as well as talk about What changes have been made to the public portfolio since our last video? I'll see you there all right, cool. Your fastest recap on XL. The two changes that have been made. Firstly, we have sold Alibaba. It was pretty much at a break-even price. We made around three dollars, if I remember correctly, and yeah, that's around six percent return. Secondly, we also sold AMC. That ran up quite a lot, so we sold it at a return of around twenty-five percent, also equivalent to around thirty-one US dollars. So I did not add any new money into this portfolio, but both these stocks were sold, and their money was pretty much invested directly into PaySafe as well as PayPal. Both, um, both companies have the word pay in it because we absolutely got paid on the market today. Just kidding. The reason why I went with PaySafe was because I feel like it just has excellent run-up potential going into the end of this year as well as next year. And PayPal does have their earnings coming up. And if you guys remember what happened with Lending Club, from my due diligence and what I personally researched, remember this is not financial advice, but from what I researched, I feel like PayPal is expected to do good things. I did also check that there are a lot more core options on PayPal relative to put options. So yeah, that's your fastest recap. So in total, we are up around 32% at this time of this recording since the birth of this portfolio. VU is up around 7.81%. For reference, this portfolio was made pretty much when VU was at an exact price of around $400. Hence, we are doing more than four times better than the overall market. So yeah, all in all, props to us. We've made some excellent returns. If you own some of these stocks privately and that you have been making a killing, especially um, at least from our end, if I go back to Hatch, we are up around 60% in like multiple stocks, 40% in multiple stocks. It is worth considering profit taking because historically in the market, you get around 10 to 20% per year. So when you're making this much in such a short amount of time, especially if you invested in a lot more privately and heavily, which is the case for me, like ChargePoint, Volta, SoFi, actually all of these stocks, maybe except Citigroup and DraftKings, 
I am really invested in privately myself and because of that I have done a lot of profit taking and I suggest that it is a good idea to consider at least trimming off your positions if they have had a huge run up because we know that this growth run will not last forever there will be a correction but that is for you guys to make the decisions on your own so that is all I had for today's video I'll bring myself back on the screen just to say goodbye but I have taken off the hat because it was getting really really hot and yeah my entertainment shades will be off now so I'll see you guys in the next video remember to comment like subscribe if you had a good time goodbye